Hello and welcome to Let's Play Star Ocean Till the End of Time. My name is Bad Gamer, and we are continuing this wonderful Let's Play. Um, last time we brought Nicholas back to the village, said goodbye to our crazy friends from the village, and um, fixed his music box. And now, oh now, we're back here trying to get off this goddamn planet. I have a suspicious feeling that those people who were talking before have something important in the story. Oh no. Hey, it's me. We're at the location. Transport us up as soon as you can. Like right now? Huh? Oh, no problem. I got him. I said it's okay. I haven't done anything. Yeah, I know. Now hurry up and get us out of here. What? What's wrong, Mr. Clean? My ship will be here soon. Once we're ready, it's good riddance to this hunk of rock. Yeah, I like this hunk of rock. My ship's not so big, but it's packing a gravitic warp engine. Okay. It's quite the speed deal. <laughs> hey, Cliff? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> There's something I've been meaning to ask you. Could you take off your shirt? What's that? Why does Quark's leader want to meet with me? <laughs> hey. I'm just a college student from Earth. You're a college student? <laughs> oh. You look like you're uh, 12. No comment. <laughs> <laughs> uh, That's, uh, not doing it for you, is it? No. N no? Wait. No, it's not. <laughs> Let's see. Well, I guess the biggest reason would be our leader wants to chat with you. Nice try, but that's avoiding the question. Why does your leader want to meet with me? I don't even think this guy knows. Hey, how should I know? I just do what I'm told. There's probably something our leader wants to talk you to you You think? And that something is... I don't know. Let's just find out, Fate. Well... Thank you. You'll Thank you, Mr. Clean, for, for having a clear head and not Sorry, falling but, into uh, RPG stupidity. Oh. Whoa. That's a big ship. Haha, uh -huh. beat me up, Scotty. That's a big ship. It's kind of ugly, though. Oh, what's happening over here? Mm. Oh, it's the music box. Oh, oh no! We fixed it. Haha. -ha. Why do we ki- Are these people important? In the story? What's going on? Tell me your secrets. Yeah, about not interfering. Flying your ship. Oh, this is beautiful. I love cutscenes. That looked really good. I'll admit that. Well, let's get a move on. She'll be expecting us. Who? Your the boss? The point is Beta 74737240. You got that, Mirage? Uh, no. Could you repeat the last, uh, last eight digits of that? Roger. No, my no, my name is Cliff, or Mr. Clean, either one. Engaging conventional engines, gravitic warp core, normal. Pizza is done. Welcome back. Oh. Sorry to keep you waiting. Who are you? This is my navigator and partner in crime. You, you're criminals? I leave the day-to-day -day operation. Uh. To okay. Mirage, this is our target. Why did we go through the door to where we were? Where, what? I don't know. Yes, I knew right away. How did you know? Nice to meet you, Fate. 
I'm Mirage Kos. Kos? Nice to meet you. What's too. up, Kos? I'm not gonna call you Mirage. I'm gonna call you Kos. She's Love beautiful. interest. What? Hey, you okay? Oh, was that a flashback? Why did we have to have? Oh, why did that have to be? Don't fall for it. What? She may look pretty, but she's a closy. Any funny ideas, and you're liable to meet a swift yet painful death. Why? I don't. Hey, wait a sec. Who said I was falling for Nobody. Anyone? What the hell is going on? Relax. I was just. Are you a mind her. reader, Mr. Clean? Yes, I am. I was wondering. Just how long will it take till we get to your leader? Three years, and it's gonna be in real time. Uh, we'll be there soon. It's about three hours to the rendezvous. Did I not just say three hours? Someone, someone, I said three hours. I just predicted the future, man. Mirage, I'm gonna go take a shower. <laughs> I'm leaving you in charge. Fate, come with me. Oh, I have to, Claire, my boss has to, to like talk to you to shower. shower. Go, what? Huh? What is it? I've just detected a gravitic space anomaly up ahead. Sure you did. I'm bringing us out of gravitic space to avoid it. Okay. You serious? You think it's hostile? Space? Hostile space? Oh. Space. Uh. Two Vendini battleships detected 400,000 oh, kilometers ahead. An ambush, huh? Man, it's bad enough having to worry about Federation. Open up a comm link. Okay. Are we talking to the Vendini? Let's let this go for a while. Connection confirmed. Okay, the link's open. Uh, <clears throat> this is the Eagle, a Clausian ship. We don't want any trouble with you. You're wasting your time. The enemy ships are already prepared to attack. But I wanted to hear him <laughs> be really bad at, at, at doing that. Seems they know who we've got on board. Escape's our only hope. It'll be tough without using gravitic warp, but we've got no choice. Reverse course. Conventional engines, full power. How much you want to bet we land on the planet we just went off, and then, <laughs> then we have to go through the same thing. And then there's a guy named Horton that we have to go after, and his men are attacking Whipple. We have to defeat him, and then we get a third party member, then we go back to their ship, and it's just a f paradox to happens shields. forever. And let me see a chart for this region. <laughs> Oh, I had to close the windows for that. All right, course one one six. That's a triangle. Two, six, How did you seven. figure? Activate auto evasion program. Fasten crew safety harness. There's three of us on the ship. Roger. Or do we have a bigger crew? Course entry complete. Speed maximum. Program activated. Okay. <laughs> As if we're like sur nah. No, actually I really don't. <laughs> We've evaded round one from the enemy's disruptor camp. What is this a horde mode? Right. I love how we just aren't allowed to see this. They didn't want to animate this. It's just a shaky ship. Like, I don't care. I want to see the awesome. Like, you have really cool things. I want to see the cutscenes. They're really well done, but they only last like two seconds. Get us on a straight line between the ships and that planet. Then pop us up star side. We'll open up the distance that way. I don't even know what that meant. But we won't be able to designate our warp destination. You guys get something to eat? Uh, I haven't eaten in like four days. Oh no, I guess I ate. Our odds ain't that bad. You got a hunch? Nope. Roger. You landed on a random planet for no reason, kid. Don't question Mr. Clean. The enemy's fired again. Four rounds now approaching. <laughs> oh, huh? This is gonna be close. Either we enter gravitic warp first or we get pumped. 
Or you could. Now's the time to pray, gentlemen. And lady. Unfortunately, it looks like we might lose the race. Here comes the first round now, and we're seven seconds from objective point. Ah, uh, who cares if we take a few rounds? Warp our butts out of here. Warp engine damaged, but still functioning. You bet it is. Activate. <laughs> you bet it is. <laughs> oh yes. Fire! Fire! Oh. Yay! We made it. Haha. -ha. Stupid Vendini ships. We've thrown off the Vendini ships. Oh, obviously. They don't have warp drive? That was close. Yeah, it was, Mr. Clean. Yes, it's a good thing we use your cleaning products. Well, it can't be helped. Besides. It won't hurt to make her wait a little longer. So, the boss is a woman. Wow, your hunch really paid off. <laughs> Finally, some respect. Nope. Yeah, a healthy respect for your recklessness. We... we I... <sighs> what is that supposed to mean? A little more honesty would be not Like, hey, that cliff sure is something. Or, you're a genius. <laughs> sure, cliff. cliff, you're a genius. Sorry to interrupt while you're having so much fun. We're not. What is it, Mirage? More of Andini ships. Now I have the to go through the same thing. Is overheating. We should reduce speed immediately. The engine will scram if we don't. Scram? Like, what? What? Didn't I specifically request that you tell me these things sooner? She just told you when it Did just happened. Roger. No, his name is Cliff. People make me so angry. Bad news. What? Are you a no. robot? Both the conventional and gravitic warp engines have scrammed. The backup engine isn't. Now we're gonna land anything. on some other planet, and uh, I'd say we have a problem. You, uh, I'd say, I'd yeah. say, I'd say. <laughs> Calm down, there, Cliff. Where are we now? I don't. You know what? I think we'll find out that next episode uh this has been let's play star ocean till the end of time my name is bad gamer next episode we'll find out where are we now i don't know where we are so it's new to me too bye folks